in this video I'll show you how to connect a Windows PC computer to your HP Envi 6400 series printer. It could be a 6452E like this one or a 6455E, it doesn't matter. As long as it looks like this one, it will work the same way. And then I'll show you how to print and how to scan. But first, let's connect both together. The first step is to make sure that your printer is turned on, obviously. This light should be on as well, this means that the printer is ready or it's asleep. And then on the back, you should have this round button that is the Wi-Fi button. You need to press it during 3 seconds until the light on the front turns to purple. Let me show you. So right now the light is blue. Let me press on it. So I'm pressing one, two, three, and it's turning to purple. I can release the button and set this printer aside. This will mean that the printer is now ready to get paired with your computer. Next step, open the Microsoft Store on your PC computer. And you're going to search for HP Smart. HP smart you need to download the hp smart app and when you're done open the app once you open the app it should look like this this is the main menu and if you have already a printer connected you're gonna see it here if not you're gonna have an add new printer button that you need to click on the top there if you don't see it don't worry you're gonna click on this button over here where you see a printer with a plus symbol click once and then it will search for your HP printer just have to wait a few seconds and you'll see a list of all the printers that have been detected here we go HP Envi 6400 series you're gonna click on this one where it says setup then you're gonna press continue then from here you're gonna press no thanks you should see over here the name of your Wi-Fi network, the one that you're using at home or at the office, and you're going to have to type the password of this network. Once the password is typed, you're going to press connect. During this process, it will ask you to type the I button on the printer itself. It's this I button that is flashing here, you just have to press it once and the setup will con continue itself on the computer. Finally, you're going to have this green arrow over here saying that the connected uh, printer is now ready. You're going to press continue. Then you should see appearing this NVI 4500 series is connected, printer, print driver Print driver successfully installed, perfect, going to press continue. And you will arrive in the main page of the HP app. Make sure to have an HP account before continuing because you won't be able to print or even scan using your PC at all. To uh, create a new account, go over here in this corner and tap on it. It will take just a few seconds, you'll create an HP account and you'll be logged in ready to use these features that I'll show you just in a few seconds. So let's start by how to scan. This printer has two different scanners. One is the top feeder over here. In case you're having multiple pages, okay, here I have a document with multiple pages, you're going to place them facing up. So with the text facing up and with the top of the page first. You just need to glide them like this. The printer will also make a noise telling you that the pages have been detected. Then on the computer, you're going to go down until you see scan. Press on scan. Then from here under source, you're going to select in document feeder. If it's not already selected, you just have to click on it. Make sure document feeder is selected. And here you don't have to change anything unless you're scanning some pictures. Then you have to click on resolution here and select 300 dpi if you're if you're scanning a text you can select 150 dpi this will be enough and then press the scan button that was right to here 
the printer will take one by one each pages, you don't have to touch anything, just wait for it to be done. Once the printer finished, you're gonna see on the screen here appearing all the scanned pages. It will even make a cute little sound telling you that it's done. On the left side here, all the pages will be displayed. If you want to rotate them, you just have to click on this icon if you're not happy with the orientation. And then you can simply click on save, get a new name, select basic PDF if you want all these pages to be combined in one single PDF, and then click save. If you just want to scan one page, so you don't want to use the top feeder, this, scan, uh, this uh, printer has another scanner that is located over here. Take your page, place it facing down this time with the text like that, and the top part of the page going this way. Then you need to align it to this corner over here by gliding the paper until this corner of the paper touches the corner of the scanner. Close the lid. On your computer, you're gonna select scan again. And this time, what's different is that you're gonna select, whoops, I'll click scan again here. You're gonna select under source scanner glass. This needs to be selected. And again, this is up to you to decide. Click scan when you're done. This time it will be much quicker since it's only one page that has to be scanned. You'll hear the noise again and the page will be displayed here. Again, you can print, save on your computer, even fax it, whatever. Use those options the way you want. Now let me show you how to print a document. Go on your PC in the folder where your PDF document or your JPEG document, depending what you want to print is. Open it. Then select the print icon. It's usually on the top left corner. If not, you can always, you just need to keep pressed control and then press just once on P while you keep pressing on control. And this window will open up. It's just a shortcut. Then you need to make sure that over here where it says printer, you select the right one. So click over here, go down until you see until you see HP NVI 6400 series. Okay, select it. And here it's up to you to modify these settings. When you're done, just press the print button. By the way, before doing this, I forgot to tell you, make sure that you have enough paper in the paper tray of your printer. And you can also extend this flap over here. Then you can press print. Here we go. Great. So this is how you connect your PC computer to your HP NVI printer. Please leave a like, write a comment. Also, subscribe to this channel. It's always helpful. And I'll see you in the next one.